And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. We've got baseball on the show. It's the Philadelphia Phillies taking on the San Francisco Giants. With Chris Singleton, I'm John Chum. And seeing you the big bat in the lineup so far this year, Brandon Bell leads the team at OPS. So he's the guy that looks to slug and basically make things happen for them offensively. Just a machine in terms of production at the plate. He'll take his walks, he'll barrel up the baseball, put the ball in the gap, so hit the ball over the fence. So talk about a guy going good. That's him right now, and he's a bat that you want to stay away from if you're the pitcher. Just about ready to roll on the hill here today. Alex Wood. It's going to be hard to top his last start, Siggy. He was outstanding. Complete game shutout. He got some great support from his defense. He's got the swing and miss stuff. Everything working for him. We'll see if he's got it today. All right, ready to get underway. Gene Segura at the plate here. Leading off the afternoon for Philadelphia, the second baseman, Gene Segura. The pitch. Fastball in for a strike, and we are underway. First pitch, 106. Next one misses, and that's ball one. Fouled off down the right side. Ground ball up the middle, and a base hit. Off to a good start with a leadoff knock. Batting second. The third Here's base. Chris Bryant now. Chris Bryant. In there, and it's 0 1. The pitch. That one is absolutely belted. That's back there. And that one's gone into the bleachers. Chris Bryant pops one out of here. And they throw a pair on the board. It's 2-0. That's exactly the pitch he was looking for. Crushes it and hits it out of the ballpark. Here's Harper in the Another solid power season. First pitch just misses. Part of the order coming through now and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. Next pitch misses, and the count is 2-0. Oh. Kicks and fires. That one's spoiled, and the count now 2-1. and one. That's down and in. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Well, he tried to nibble right there and just missed his spot. Hitter didn't offer at it. Now he has somebody to worry about over at first. And now it's the cleanup spot for the Phillies. Brandon Jordan in there for strike one. And that's down and away. Kicks and deals. There's a strike. So far, all we've seen in the sit bat are fastballs. Look for him to slow it down right here ahead in the count.
Here's a one-two. Swing and a pop-up. Racing makes the catch. And there's one down. Nice. And time now for the Phillies lineup. In that leadoff spot, a guy they're looking to get going, Gene Segura. Yeah, he's really slumping at the plate right now. Not only is he having a hard time finding any base hits, he's just not finding a way to get on base either. Sometimes a walk can get you back on track. Less than a 250 on base percentage over his last 10 games. So that kind of tells me that he's jumpy, he's not recognizing the pitches, and he's out of his plate discipline. I got to think he's looking for ways to try to simplify that approach. And I think if you can just let the ball travel a little bit deeper, make sure you see it, that will help you to put good ABs together. And even if you don't get hits, you'll draw some walks. No, Over to first, and he saved. Next offering is in for a strike. Got him. Two down. Trevor Story comes up to the plate. The shortstop. Trevor Story. First pitch doesn't find the zone. And he deals right through there for a strike. Harper off of first with two away. Pitches in there, and it's one and two. Well, with this many pitches thrown here in this first inning, I mean, you're giving the other team a really good look. He's going to have to find a way to get some weak contact, maybe a swing and miss, get into that dugout and hit the reset button. And he chases that one. Out number three. Plus two come across to score in the inning, courtesy of this two-run homer. And it's two zip. Bottom of the first. And today's starter, Zach Wheeler. Chris, he's got the ability to take control of a game when he's out there. Well, incredible mound presence, and he's going to attack hitters. Look at that strikeout per nine ratio over 10 coming into this start. So he's a pitcher that wants the ball. He's aggressive. He knows that he can get the swing and miss, especially when he needs it most. We'll see how effective he is in this one. And a pitch. Wilmer Flores in the box now as he leaves that one up high. Next offering is fouled back. Next one is off the plate, and it's two and one. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. Hey. Now, just a cement mixer slider right there. It's a great pitch to hit if you can recognize it early and jump on it. And yeah, the righty deals. Stays alive. Good zip on that fastball at the bottom of the zone. If he's there all day, it's going to be a tough one for the hitters. The wind of the pitch. Foul ball, he stays alive. Next pitch misses inside, and it's three and two. And the right hander deals. Swing and a miss, struck him out. One gone, bottom half of the first. Well, he should get some fist bumps when he gets back into the dugout Batting because second. even though he no, strikes out, he saw a lot of pitches and he battled. And this is a long haul where you're trying to get that pitch count up as early as possible. So gave the guys behind him an opportunity to see what's working for this pitcher or not. But I tell you what, 
It's a nice job right there. Steven Duggar stands in here, leaves that one off the inside. And it's one and one. Well, you got to find a way to catch up to that pitch. Perhaps shorten the swing, eliminate the stride. That one came in hot, but right down the middle, you're saying to yourself, how did I miss that pitch? Got to make a quick adjustment. And he lays down a bunt. And he picks it up in foul territory. Left hand hitter waits. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And here this afternoon, two quickly away in the bottom of the first. Well, anytime you can that punch out the top two guys in the, the lineup to start an inning, you got to be feeling pretty good out there on the mound because when you think of just having a distraction, table setters on the base paths, and all of a sudden you're dealing with the number three hitter, any distraction can cause you to serve up a cookie, and instead of it being a solo shot, it's a two- or three-run homer. Up to the plate is Brandon Belt. That one's in there, 0-1. And the slider catches the zone. Looks really sharp at the start of this one. This is how it's going to be today. It's going to be a tough one for this lineup. And a pitch. And one and two. One and two. The pitch. That's inside. Boog, he never moved because he never had time to. With that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. Righty delivers. Three. Got him. Strikes out the side to begin the game. What a start. Impeccable command in that one. Three batters, three strikeouts. That's electric stuff out there on the mound. Top of the second. Now at the plate, Kyle Schwarber. Leading off for Philadelphia, the left fielder, Kyle Schwarber. And a pitch. Just off the inside edge. He needs a quick one, two, three this time around. Last inning, threw a lot of pitches. Pitch. Late swing, foul to the left. And a 1 1. There's a swing and a drive. Back there. And out of here. Kyle Schwarber goes deep. His 27th home run of the season. It's 3 0. That pitch was intended to stay inside, but it leaked out over the middle of the plate. Hitter waited on it, and he connected just perfectly. And the batter now is Reese Hoskins. Batting eight. The first base first base pitch, and that's in for a strike. Oh, Always exciting oh, to see a leadoff home run in an inning. Kind of gets the offense fired up, and you start to expect a big inning. The pitch. That misses the zone, and now it's even one and one. Rusty Valentine doing the umpiring behind the dish for us. Maybe the best name in the league. <laughs> yeah, that's a solid one, no doubt. I mean, who's better to ask than you? I kind of wonder if Rusty's his actual name or just a nickname. Yeah, no clue. Wind of the pitch. That one fouled off. Two and two. Oh. 
Hoskins pushes it foul. Two two now. Stays the line. Two two now. Swing and a line drive. Base hit out of the center field. And now it is JT Real Muto, JT. known for his rocket arm behind the plate. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at all. Next offering misses, ball one. And now the lefty. High fly ball down the left field line. Wait, right there to make the grab. And there's one down. Good pitch. He just kind of had him out in front on that pitch away and wasn't able to stay close. Now batting. The second baseman. Gene. So the Philly batting order Segura. turns over. And now for the Phillies, Gene Segura. In there and it's 0-1. Kelly left that change up up. Got away with one there and he'll take it but doesn't want to make that mistake again. Fouled off. He was late. Swing and a miss and he struck him out. And two away now. Now, Boog, it becomes pretty difficult as a teammate when a guy's struggling like this. You don't know if you want to go up and tell him to keep swinging it or if you want to give him his space, what exactly he needs. But right now, it's clearly a struggle for him, and you're just hoping that somehow, some way, it'll click and he can get out of this as quickly as possible. And at first, Chris Bryant gets a chance to hit here. And that's in there for strike one. Wanted one. At the belt and fires. Not nope. close with that one. Two balls and a strike. He's been trying to tease the zone with that slider, but these hitters have showed patience not going outside the strike zone. And the pitch. Turned on, but foul wide of third. pitch to the right side and it's through for a hit throw in holds the lead runner at second two on now with two away right fielder number three just Price. a simple ground ball the other way that had eyes on it man sometimes that's all you need to do just let the ball travel put the ball in play and just hope it finds a hole here's Bryce Harper one of the elite home run hitters in the league this year One's in there, 0 and 1. When you're struggling out there on the mound, hitters know that there'll be plenty of opportunities within the at bat to try to get something to hit hard. Two outs, couple of base runners at first and second. Popped up to the left, into foul ground. Brings it in for the third out. The Phillies add another on this solo homer. It's now 3 0. Back here at the ballpark, bottom half of inning number two. Mike Yastrzemski up here. 
the Giants the in striking distance, but have some work to do. Berg starts with the leadoff man. Need a good at bat out of him right here. And here it comes. That one close, rule the ball. And that is ball one. Right-hander kicks, deals. And that one fouled off. Left-hand batter waits. The other way, drops in for a hit, couldn't run it down. Well, the last 10 games or so have been anything but fun at the plate for him, that so that one has it. to feel good. Oh, Pretty much a bottle swing oh, on that one as he drifted into the opposite field gap, and I'm sure he's going to be watching that one back on video because that's the kind of swing you want to bottle. So many positives that led to that knock. And you can feel this crowd waking up a bit here as the guys are starting to make some noise with their bats. Tommy Listella looks at one outside there. And the 1 0. -oh. On the ground, right side, and it gets by him. Lead runner holds up. They're at first and second with nobody out. That exists. Kind of rolled field. over on this pitch a little bit, but he got enough behind it to yeah. shoot it through for a knock. And we'll take that anytime you can get him to find a hole. Here's Lamont Wade Jr. First pitch, and he just misses. Yastrzemski over at second. Listella out at first with nobody out. Next offering is down low, and it's 2-0. pushed foul out of play off to the left. Well, they gave up on that pitch early, and it ended up staying in the zone. I'm sure he's kicking himself and would like that pitch again. The next offering misses. Three and one now. him for a strike first and second here no outs the punch out there down on strikes and he knew it here's Brandon Crawford not shortstop Brandon Crawford check swing went around going one This is inside. The 1 1. In the air, fairly deep to right field. Harper makes the grab. Two away. Batting eight. The catcher. This is Joey Bart. Taken high in the draft, he's had that top prospect labeled over him since he put on a professional uniform. But at some point, that starts to go away, and you've got to produce at the big league level. And a foul ball left side. First and second, two down. Next pitch off the plate. 
One ball, one strike. The guy at the plate could recognize slider out of the hand. Didn't stay in the tunnel very long in terms of depth and perception. He knew right away it was an off-speed pitch. A 1-1. One, one. Big swing and a miss. Yeah, Spin rate's outstanding on that high fastball. Really tough to hit. Next one misses. Two balls, two strikes. And a pop-up, right side, foul territory. Hoskins makes the catch, and that'll do it. Giants leave a couple. They trail in this one, 3-0. Top half of the third inning, and now here's a speed threat. Outfielder, Brandon the Jordan. The center fielder, Brandon Jordan. Wood back to work. It's been a rough start on the mound for this guy. This third okay. inning is so important for him to get on track, turn the page, settle in, do all those things you need to do to give your team a little oh, bit of one. length in this one. The next one pitch ball, misses. Right. And one and one. Kicks and fires. And that's a base hit into left field. And a board on the leadoff single. Man, those are the types of hits where you don't feel any vibration in your hands whatsoever. Such a good feeling. Solid swing from start to end. On time with everything. Really good balance. Nice extension. And he met it out front for the line drive knock. And now they've got some speed on first. So we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Nick Castellanos at the plate now. In there for strike one. Ball one, and a pitch. Ball one. Two. Right and a foul ball, he stays alive. A little early on that fastball, I'm sure the pitcher taking a note. Look for an off speed pitch on this next one. And he deals. Swing and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Here's Trevor Story now. now. Batting. Shortstop. Trevor Story. Throw to first, back standing. He's in there safely. In there, and it's 0 1. The pitch. And there's something you don't see very much in today's game, the pitch out. Jordan, the base runner at first with one out. Next pitch inside, and it's two and one. And fouled off. Starting to get some pretty good timing on that breaking ball, but he's going to have to stay ready for a fastball. Don't want to watch one go right by you. Pick off move to first. Jordan dives back in safely. Yeah. 
Another move to first. And they're keeping him close. And a pitch. Got him. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. Well, oh, big power guy right there and generating so oh, much bat speed. It's hard to bring that to a halt once you've committed. They tried to check the swing, just couldn't do it. He's going and there he goes. Ball outside. Throw to second and great jump. Well, it really doesn't matter what the situation is. When a guy like this gets on first, you know he's going to steal second at some point during the at-bat. Nice job to get in the scoring position. The defense probably knew it was coming, but they just couldn't do anything to stop it. Left-hand hitter waits. That one way outside, and it's two and one. Two outs. Two outs, and one in scoring position. That one wrapped foul. Three two now. Right side. To first. And that is that. One left for Philadelphia, but they lead it three nothing. Now it's Evan Longoria's turn. Having more success against left-handed well pitching done. this season as might be expected. Evan Longoria. The wind and the pitch. That one's in there, and that is strike one. If he doesn't get a knock right here, that pitch he just took is going to eat at him for a while. You might not see another pitch like that from a top-level guy like this. Righty to the plate. Inside just missed. Nope. And there's a the ball. The line to kick the pitch. And it's fouled away. The 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One gone, bottom of the third inning. Well, that's a curveball that I'm sure he wants back at the plate. Two now strikes. Pass. Sort of pitch you're hoping for. A bit of Will a mistake. Burn. And I'd say in a very hittable location. But clearly the break was enough to get him to swing through it. And now it's Wilmer Flores. And that one fouled off. Kick Sandios. That one ripped. That's a hit. So they get a man aboard with a one out single. Nice job the going the opposite field. way with Number it. Six. Letting the ball travel and not He's allowing there. the barrel to hook around the ball. It's so frustrating when you see a good pitch and your hands roll over. He's on the outside part of the plate, and he approached it perfectly. Now batting Steven Duggar. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Righty delivers. And a foul ball. Oh, 
Next pitch misses, and the count is one and two. And the righty deals. And now the count is even. Sometimes you got to fight to get back into it at bat. Take some tough pitches, even out the count. Here comes the pitch. Not even close there. Three and two down. pitch cut on and miss struck him out and there's two down and at first Brandon Bell the Number next nine. giant to hit Brandon Bell first pitch well. not close At the belt and fires. And a strike in there. One and one. And the right hander deals. Rolled softly, but that goes foul. And the pitch. And he grounds one to the right side. Hoskins takes it to the bag. Play made. That ends the inning. One left for San Francisco. They trail it here. Three nothing. Back here in San Francisco. And it's Reese Hoskins up to the dish. Leading off for Philadelphia. The first baseman, number 17, Reese Hoskins. The pitch. On a line, base hit. And that rolls into the corner. Around first and hustling for second. The relay throw. He's in there. That ball was absolutely ripped. 111 off the bat. And I'm pretty sure it started to whistle after it left the bat. I think I heard that too, Boog. And these are the moments we appreciate when we can look at StatCast and just see exactly what the data is. Always so much fun to see what numbers pop up. JT Real Muto steps in. No outs. Runner on second. Next offering is in for a strike. Action in the pen down there. Alex Cobb, the right-handed sinker baller. He looks to be readying himself. McGee warming up as well. Runner leads away at second. Check swing. Tried to hold up. Now an appeal to first. And that's a swing according to umpire Mike Fillmore. And a pitch. And a good eye oh, there. Hoskins leads off second with nobody out. Oh, now this one gets away at the plate. In there oh, safely. In there. Not what you're looking for after the leadoff double. A strikeout, and there's one away. And here's the Phillies' leadoff the man, Gene Segura. Second base. And Boog, I'd say he's Gene. due. Segura. First offering misses the mark. That's through there for a strike.
And now the lefty going to count one and two. One ball, two strikes to count. And a pitch. In the air, right field. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. Runner tags for home. Low throw, and he can't take it out. Two outs, base is empty. Chris Bryant stands in for the Phillies. And the first pitch misses for ball one. He didn't want to give up that run, but he did. Got the fly ball, sack fly out. Now it's time to attack these other guys. Get your team back in the dugout. The lefty, the 1-0. You know, with the shift on, hits right into it. Whips it to first. Ryan out of the play. Third out. On now to the bottom of the fourth. It's the Phillies four and the Giants nothing. Welcome back. John Chabi and Chris Singleton with you. And leading off the leading bottom of the fourth, the Mike Giants. Yastrzemski. The right fielder. Yastrzemski. pitch slapped foul he's been pitching well but going through this middle of the order second time through we'll see what kind of adjustments are being made ball. the next offering misses and it's a ball to strike right hander kicks deals towards first and foul ball That misses the zone, and the count's even at two. Got him looking, and one away. Just absolutely rolling on the mound. He's looking very much on his game in the early now parts of this one, Boo. Fully on the attack with these hitters. That's seven Love strikeouts Love. already, so he's got a good pace going, no doubt. Tommy Listella to the plate. And that's in there for strike one. Oh and one. Ball oh, one there. And one and two. He's been able to go inside as well as outside, effectively working both sides of the plate in this at bat. And down on strikes he goes. Two away down. Well, definitely a borderline pitch right there, and he didn't look too convinced as he headed no back to the dugout. You know, those are tough ones to let go as a hitter, but with the human umpire calling balls and strikes, it's always going to be on you to protect yourself with two strikes. Lamont Wade Jr. will hit next. 0 for 1, he struck out swinging last time. In there for strike one. He's pitching well, but not throwing a ton of first pitch strikes. Usually doesn't work out for success, but you can never predict baseball. Hey. Next offering is in for a strike. The pitch. I got to count one and two. Rip to third and caught. Giants go down quietly. They're on the short end of a 4-0 score.
Ready now for the fifth inning. And digging in for Philadelphia, Bryce Harper. Moving off for Philadelphia, the right fielder, number three, Bryce Harper. And he deals. And that one just missed off the outside edge. Left hand batter waits. And that's downstairs and outside. The wind of the pitch. Hey. And that's outside. Big lefty turns, kicks, deals. Line drive, and that should be extra bases. Now he turns and heads for second. In safely, it's a leadoff double in the fifth. Oh, here we are, third time through the order, and this is where we see the OPS jump up. Manager might have to go to the bullpen a little bit sooner than he anticipated. Here comes the skipper out of the dugout, and he's ready to make the move. Alex Wood, gun for the day. We'll be back in a minute with a new arm on the mound. Alex Cobb gets the ball now. A runner on second to deal with. He'll do his best to keep him there. Well, at this point in the ball game, we're talking about middle innings. And the little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. So, man aboard. So, digging in now for Philadelphia, Brandon Jordan. Good contact guy, good defender. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there, on its way, gone. He made him pay for that one. His 42nd home run of the season. It's 6-0. That's their third home run of the game. They're having a lot of fun at the plate in this one. They've got the long ball working for them on autopilot. Welcome to the game. First pitch out of the bullpen, a tough one. And you know he's just trying to get one in there for a strike. And on the other side, as a hitter, it's a great time to be aggressive. And let it fly. It's not what they were looking for when they turned to him, but now he's got to find a way to reset. Here's Nicholas Castellanos, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. Designated hitter. Next nope. pitch downstairs, and that's ball one. And the 1 0 misses low. Struggled a little bit in this one. A couple of strikeouts earlier, but doing a much better job in this at bat to get ahead and find a good hitter's count at 2 0. Wings and misses. That's strike two. Good pitch right there. Tied him up on the hands. If I'm out there on the bump, I'm going right back in there. Swing and a base hit. And that's going to kick into the corner. Around first, digging for two. Throw is offline, and he's got a double. This offense is on fire. Three extra base hits in a row. When you connect and it jumps off your bat like that, you're thinking double at the very least. What a great swing on it, and man, he wasn't fooled at all. Here's Trevor Story. Next offering is down low. Ball one. Come on, and it's second. 
And he swings but over the top one. there. This is one of those situations where the pitcher may not really want to deal with the guy in the box. And you got to be aware of that. Take your walk. I could do it, but I think he can. He swings and drives one out to deep left field. Makes the catch up against the wall. Runner tags up for third. Not fooled at all right there. He was clearly all over it, but sometimes now you hit it too hard and right at someone. Kyle. Looking for one of those blue hits to get a knock sometimes. Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here. He's already homered here in this one. First pitch just misses. And that's in there at the knees. The pitch. And a ball oh, evens the count. Two two now. Stays alive. Castellanos stands at third with one gone in the inning. Next offering is down low. Kicks and fires. Foul ball there. And here it comes. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. The kick, the three, two. And a foul ball, he stays alive. There's the splitter in the dirt, swing and a miss. And there's two gone following the strikeout. The first baseman, number 17, Reese Hoskins. Reese Hoskins stands in for the Phillies. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Ball one, no strike. Kicks and deals. He swings and fouls one off. It's a 1-1. One, one. And there's a breaking ball that drops in there. So now one and two to Reese. Ball. Two balls, two strikes to count with two outs. Two outs with a runner at third. Two outs. Rolled over to third. Whips it across, inning over, and it could have been worse. But the Phils get two on this blast. It's now a 6 nothing ball game. And welcome back. Now it's the shortstop, Brandon Crawford. Leading up for the Giants. Clearly down in Not this ball game, stop. and you can't look Brandon. at the deficit and try to get it all back Walker. in one swing. It's got to come one at bat at a time and even shrink it down smaller, pitch to pitch. Make that guy on the mound work to get you out. Hey. Next offering is in for a strike. 
and a pitch. Two balls, one strike. Now one Great miss. Ball. He hasn't fallen behind in the count like this all day. He's in danger of walking his first batter right here. Righty to the plate. Now front pulls that one foul. Now it's three and two. Righty delivers. That one misses, so a leadoff walk. Very close off the outside corner. Could have easily been called a strike in that location. Go. And now the catcher comes up to him. Joey Bart hit it well, but fly it out to the deepest part of the outfield his first time. First offering, misses the mark. Count one and oh. Yeah, the right-hander deals. Late swing, fouled off. Rudder at first with no outs here. The next pitch misses, two and one. And the righty deals. Fouls one off. Two and two. Well, you can't really adjust your game plan for that last pitch. Guy hasn't thrown it very much. You got to focus on the stuff that he's throwing up there most of the time. At the belt and fires. Stays alive. Nobody out. Runner at first. Next offering misses, and that's ball three. One is lifted in the air. Jordan gliding as he moves to his left. Racing makes the catch. One away. Now batting third baseman, Evan Longoria. Now the third baseman, Evan Longoria. In there and it's 0-1. Man, 91 on the slider right there. That's a hard one. That's a low-end fastball for some guys. Next pitch is downstairs. Right-hander kicks, deals. Liner, and that should be extra bases. Crawford coming home. Oh, the throw is wild. Run comes across all the way from first to cut the lead. It's 6-1. A little more back spin on that instead of the top spin. And he's jogging around the bases rather than pulling up at second. Now it's the Giants' leadoff hitter, Wilmer Flores. One for two. The second baseman, Wilmer Flores. And the first offering is not close. Two 
just off, off the plate. outside part of the plate. Right. And the pitch. That to right. And that one hops the wall. And now the center fielder, Steven Duggar. The center fielder, number six, Steven Duggar. Now fly ball to right center. Harper pulls that one down, and there's two away. The first baseman, number nine, Brandon Bell. And now, Brandon Bell. And there's a foul ball. Next pitch is inside, and it's one and one. Left hand hitter waits, and a foul ball. Flores, the runner at first with two gone. Slides, but it gets by him. Throw stops the lead runner at second. Two on and two out. Now that is First right and field. second, two down. Now it's the right fielder, Mike Yastrzemski. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Two on, two outs. And the pitch is in for a strike. And it's one and one. Here comes the pitch. Little trouble with this one behind the plate. But no advance from the runners. Next one misses, and that's ball three. The pitch. And they're all loaded up. Well, interesting, he went with the off speed and walked the hitter. Man, you gotta challenge the guy with the fastball. The designated hitter. So two down now, and here is Tommy LaStella. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Tough situation right here. So important as a pitcher to get ahead in the count, as he did right there. Base is loaded, two down. Next pitch misses, and the count even, one and one. Next pitch is popped up, and that one actually will be grabbed by Story, and that will end the inning. We're through five. It's the Philly six and the Giants two. Here at Oracle Park. All right, we go to the 
Top half of inning number six. Here's the catcher, JT Real Muto. A line to kick the pitch. And first offering is fouled off. A wind in the pitch. Here's a strike. No ball, two strikes. A wind in the pitch. Gonna count one and two. And a pitch. Great job of laying off those pitches down in the zone to even the count up at two and two. Such a better feeling for the hitter. Rips one to right and a base hit. So now back to the top of the order. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Next to hit, Gene Segura. Nope. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Ball one, no strikes to Segura. This to third, and it gets by him. Just one of those seen eye base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you a knock. the number two hitter, Chris Bryant. And it was a homer back in the first inning that got his day started at the plate. Yeah, Boog, a two-run blast. His fans were just still getting into their seats here at the ballpark. So if you showed up late to this one, you missed out on a big moment early on. Hey. That one's in there, 0-1. One. Well, an at-bat can be a little bit of a dance. Strike one here, but more pitches we'll see how it turns out Segura at second with nobody out and he's down 0-2 as he swings through it and a foul ball he stays alive pitch stays alive this one bounced to Longoria gathers and throws to first now one gone at the top of the sixth the right fielder number three Bryce Harper. Bryce Harper stands in for the Phillies. Really good piece of hitting last time going to the opposite field. First pitch just misses. Man at second. Swang and a high fly ball in the air left field. That's bad. And that one is going to go. Bryce Harper goes deep. Home run number 40 on the year. And they add a couple more. It's 9-2. Man, he just barely got that one out of here and you've got to love the effort and left to try and bring it back he had a good shot at it just couldn't quite pull it off it would have been a stunner if he did so here comes jake mcgee into the game he's into the game with the base is empty number 17. 
मध्ये Brandon Jordan stands in for the Phillies. The center field, number 25, Brandon Jordan. Hard hit, left side. Zips it to first, two gone now. A quick move to his left, fully extended there in front of the shortstop to make the grab. Up with it, then a strong, accurate throw across the diamond to complete this highlight play. Here's the Phillies DH, Nick Castellanos. This to third. Longoria to first. And that is that. Bryce Harper brings the power for Philly. It's now a 9-2 ball game. Back here at the ballpark, bottom of the sixth inning. Here's the left fielder, Lamont Wade Jr. No so every field. pitcher wants to run support and having a lead is nice, but it can be challenging for some guys. I think keeping the mindset to attack instead of trying to be too fine and have too much finesse, go after hitters and get quick outs. This one lifted in the air, left field. Schwarber under it. Puts the squeeze on that one. One down. The batter number 35. Shortstop, Brandon. And now the shortstop, Crawford. Brandon Crawford. Hey. And that's in there for strike one. Activity in the bullpen. Kyle Gibson up and loosening in the pen. Eflin getting loose as well. One down, base is empty. That's a strike. Quickly down 0-2 in the count. I think you got to choke up a little bit, spread out the feet. You don't know what the velocity or the location of this next pitch is going to be. 0-2 now. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. That's out number two. Just blown away in that at bat. Three fastballs, all oh, strikes. He wasn't even able to foul one off. There's not much you can take away from an at-bat like that as a hitter other than maybe there's something wrong with your eyes. Got to have better timing on the fastball next time. And here's the catcher, Joey Bart. In there for strike one. And a pitch. And that's outside. And he deals. Oh, damn. One fouled off, two and two. Two down, nobody on. And a foul ball, he stays alive. And now it's filled up. The wind of the pitch. And yeah, there's ball four. Well, that's a nice job of grinding out that at bat. Saw a lot of pitches and ends up drawing the wall. Very third pretty. Baseman. Here's Evan. the third baseman, Evan Longoria. Longoria. Hit hard, base hit. They stopped the lead runner at second. Now two on with two outs. Right there, he does a great oh, job of staying in the big part of the field. Man, the there are a lot of hits there. Wilbur. Flores. 
And the Phillies manager making his way towards the mound now as he will make a move. Zach Wheeler won't go any further, and the line not closed on him yet as he's responsible for the runners on base. Back with a new pitcher after this. Out of the bullpen for the Phillies, Kyle Gibson. And he's got a nice lead to work with. And digging in for San Francisco, Wilmer Flores. On the ground, the first base hit. So that's two straight, two out hits. Runner at third, puts on the brakes. Base is now loaded with two away. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. I really like that swing, man. He didn't just push it the other way to the infield. He drove it that way. And it kind of makes me think he was thinking opposite field as he stepped into the box. Got a pitch he liked, and he got it done. Could be a chance here for them to start clawing back into this ballgame. Bart, the runner at third, Longoria at second, Flores on at first with two down. Hey. Next offering is in for a strike. Not the easiest thing when you're talking about a guy that's, you know, perhaps is going to be in the rotation, or maybe a long relief guy to not start an inning, to come into an inning with. Swung out, Deep! That one went back there, and that one's going to land not so much here. But here, an absolutely majestic shot. His ninth homer of the year, it's 9-6. This crowd back alive. a great job here of staying within himself you know that if you get a knock you're going to drive in a couple so stay focused on that well he does more than just a knock it's the grand slam to drive in four really good job of play. so two down and the batter now brandon bell the first baseman number nine brandon First Whoa, offering and it just misses. Well, it's easy to be satisfied and get a little distracted after a grand slam, but there's still a lot of work in this inning to do, and you can really deliver a knockout blow. Next pitch is outside. Is there a little wrinkle to that? I think there was. Yeah, a little slider action. And they slice into the lead. It's 9 7. Back homer is always a special feeling at the ballpark, especially if it's your team that does it and those guys get to slap hands at home plate. This is the kind of thing that can really fire up the ball play. New pitcher on now, Bailey Fulton. 32nd appearance. For Philadelphia. Number 70, Bailey Fulton. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Mike Yastrzemski. The right fielder, number five. First Strike. offering, misses the mark. Yastrzemski. The pitch. So two balls and no strikes. pitch misses with the 2-0 and he's fired three straight outside the strike zone
And now the lefty. That's in for a strike. And here it comes. Fouls one away and now three and two. Left hand batter waits. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. But the damage was done right here as you get another look at the Grand Slam home run. It's now a 9 7 ball game. Back here in San Francisco, all set for the start of the inning. Now, Trevor Story. The shortstop. Trevor Story. And a pitch. In for a strike. Strike one. Signs of movement in the Giants' bullpen. Zach Littell appears to be getting loose. All in one now. Not the best swing that time from the first round pick. The 0 2. And ball one. Kicks and deals. That one missing inside. And a pitch. And now the count filled up three and two. This is a really good feeling for a hitter. At this point in the ball game, you know that they don't want to walk you, so you're going to get a pitch to hit. You just better not miss it. On the ground right side. Dives, but it kicks off his glove. And he beats it. That's a hit. Great try there. Into second easily with a leadoff double. Now back, left field, Kyle. Well, you can't give him two errors on that play, but that's pretty much what it looked like. Tried to stay with it after the bobble, and he might have pulled it off with a good throw, but it's very easy to rush the throw when you don't field it cleanly. A lot of times guys don't have a good grip on it, and I think that was the case right there. He launched the solo shot back in the second inning of this one. Yeah, that was big for these guys early on. Definitely helped him get off onto the right foot. Ball Next one. pitch downstairs, and that's ball one. Slider misses outside. Not showing great command so far in this at bat. 2-0 count. He's got to execute here or this could get ugly. Two and one now. Late with the swing there. One thing on his mind right there with that swing. He's trying to go deep. Runner at second. Nobody out. The next pitch misses. Three and two now. Runner leads away at second. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. And 
football for Chua Board. Well, they didn't give him anything to hit, and now with runners on first and second, they've set up a double play opportunity, so not a terrible result. Here's a big power threat, Reese Hoskins. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Looking for some insurance, or as our friends down in the south would say. Insurance. No matter how you say it, we know what you mean. The pitch. Out front and foul to the left side. pitch in the air left field wait should have this one squeezes it and there's one down and up to the plate is JT Real Muto First offering is fouled off. Here comes a pitch. And a foul ball. Runners at first and second with one gone. Grounded to third, could be two. Over to Flores, that's one. On to Bell, it's two. Poetry in motion there is the second baseman. Turns the double play. Nice throw to first. That's the way to end the end. Welcome back, bottom of the seventh. And now the DH, Tommy Lestella. For the Giants. The designated hitter, Tommy Lotella. A wind of the pitch. That's in there. That's strike one. Way high. Ball to strike. Little chopper rolls foul. On the ground, out to short. Tosses to first. One up, one down. Now back. Go left field. Warm up. Now the left fielder, Lamont Wade Jr. Hit on the ground to the right side. Hoskins steps on the bag. And a couple of quick outs. Now that is a shortstop. Brandon. Crawford. Stepping in, Brandon Crawford. A strikeout and a walk. First pitch, and he just misses. Just off the inside edge. The wind to kick the 2-0. And a breaking ball drops in for a strike. Nasty 2-0 slider there for a strike. That tells you he's got a lot of confidence in that pitch. The 2-1. Pulls that one foul. The next offering misses. Full count now.
Right, right through there. Got him. And good work there as he gets a 1-2-3. Giants down in order. They still trail by a couple. It's 9-7. And welcome back. Here's the second baseman, Gene Segura. Leading off for the Phillies, the second baseman, Gene Segura. And he deals. Strike one. And a pitch. Just missed. A 1-1. One, one. Good eye right there. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Two and two. Well, and those hitters count sometimes can be a little too aggressive, and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's got to get a better pitch to hit. At the belt and fire. Swing and a foul back. That's out of play. A little tardy on that fastball. He's going to have to get it going a little quicker. Get that front foot down. The pitch. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul ball. The pitch. That misses the zone, and the count's full. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. What a battle. It's not always easy laying off a 3-2 pitch, and I tell you what, he earned that ball. Down the third baseman, Chris Bryant. First pitch, just misses. Segura gets his lead at first with nobody out. Next offering is in for a strike. And there's a strike. And here it comes. That one just misses. That's awfully close. I don't know how you take that. He's seeing the ball out of the pitcher's hand really well right now. The 2-2 down. Fastball, he gets out of the way. Still just the second batter of the inning. And on the mound, he's already thrown 13 pitches. They've got him working hard out there. Kicks and fires. Up the middle. Nice stop. Over to Crawford. To first. Double play. Nicely done. Now back to right field. And now here is Harper. That one's in there, 0-1. One. One. Two down, nobody on. Nope. That's out to center field. Duggar on his way over. Makes a nice running catch. And that will end the inning. Trust me when I tell you no exceptions to the rule. Bringing blessings when I move.
special one. Chris Sir Anthony Dominguez has checked into the game. On for the 30th time this year. Oh, he's having an excellent season so far. ERA is under two. A lot of flexibility coming out of the bullpen. Bottom of the eighth. And now here is Joey Bart. Leading up for the Giants. The catcher, Joey Bart. And the pitch. High in the air, out to right. Harper makes the grab. One pitch and one out. Now batting. The third baseman, Evan. And now Long Evan Lagori. First offering is fouled off. Foul ball. Righty to the plate. Longoria tries to hold up, appeal to first, and he held up. Next Whoa, one off yeah. the plate inside. Two and two. And another ball. Three balls, two strikes to count. Stays alive. And a payoff pitch. The punch out there. Now two away. Back to the leadoff spot of the Giants line. Now it's the second base. Wilmer, Wilmer Flores. Flores. First offering is fouled off. Righty delivers. Fall off foul. And the 0-2. And now one and two. To the right side, Hoskins takes it himself. Giants go in order. Giants are down one, two, three. They still trail by a couple. It's nine, seven. Zach Littell gets the call from the pen, and he'll do his best to keep this close. Look We go to the ninth. Now it's the power speed combo. Brandon Jordan. He's a guy who does it all. With the lack of contact in today's game, this guy hits for contact, so he delivers average. But there's on base that's slow too. The one up. Outside corner for a strike. Early in the count, you have to be real careful because of that power. But then. If this hitter gets a strike or two on him, he's still very comfortable. Because he has the ability to get the barrel to the baseball, he's a threat deep into the count as well. Tapped softly on the ground. Fires the first on the run. They get him, but it was pretty close. Good late bite on that slider. Got the hitter out in front, rolled over on it. Exactly what he was supposed to do. Nick Castellanos. Castellanos now in the box comes up empty with a swing there action in the San Francisco bullpen Jose Alvarez the lefty looks to be getting himself ready
Comes up empty on the swing. 0-2 oh. now. Right side. Yastrzemski settles under it. Out number two. And digging in for Philadelphia, Trevor Story. Next offering is down low, and it's one and oh. Two outs. That misses. Yeah, that's ball two. When you get ahead the count, there's no doubt that the success rate goes up. And that's what he's been doing. It's made a big impact for him in recent games. The 2-0 is in for a strike. The line to kick the pitch. Here's a chopper to short. Slings it across. And that is the third out of the inning. 2-3-4 set to hit in the bottom of the nine. It's the Phillies nine and the Giants seven. Welcome back, and here comes the closer, Corey Kniebel. He's pitching on two days rest. Here's the center fielder, Steven Duggar. He's had one of, if not the biggest swings of the game. But four up on the board with a grand slam and a six. Yeah, Bill, it's every player's dream to blast one out. When you step up to the plate, the bases are loaded, the crowd is buzzing, and when you connect, especially in a close game, man, you're just buzzing even after you round the bases. Pitch misses inside, and that is ball one. See the velocity, 97 with that fastball. Here's a 1-1. One, one. And that one missing low. Two balls, one strike. And the righty deals. Trying to punt his way on. And he grabs it in foul ground. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Swing and a miss, and he got him. And one gone. Just a mid 90s challenge fastball right there, not much to it. And no, I'm not. sure he'd love First another baseman. swing at it because it was in a very hittable location. No. Those are the swings where you can sometimes start to question yourself as a hitter and say, How did I miss that? But you know what happens? Brandon Bell, the next Giant to hit. First offering misses badly for ball one. Right-hander kicks deals. There's a strike. Just amazing to me how many closers and back-end relievers just throw absolute gas these days. I never would have had a chance. Swung on, belted. And it hits the fence. Segura relayed a second, but he's in there easily. One out, runner at set. Here's a cleanup hitter for the Giants, Mike Yastrzemski. All season long, he's racked up a number of saves, and sometimes the adrenaline doesn't get high enough until there's a runner or two on base. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Oh. 
Swing and a miss. 98 on the gun. Bell, the runner at second with one away. Swing and a chopper. Segura picks it up, and the Giants down to their final lap. Up next to the Giants, the designated hitter, Tommy Rostella. Big spot here, bottom of the ninth, down to their final out. And next is the designated hitter, Tommy Listella. In there, and it's on one. And I know you want to be patient as a hitter, but you got to be ready to jump on the first thing straight. And he got one right there, but left the bat on his shoulder. Next offering is in for a strike. Perhaps not quite ready to hit. First two pitches by him for a couple of strikes. Now back is against the wall. He's going to have to figure something out and figure it out quickly. Next nope. offering upstairs. Swing and a miss. And that's the ball game. We saw both teams come ready to swing it in this one, and they found a lot of success. A couple of touchdowns up on the board today. Pretty amazing, and it turned out to be a close one, considering all the runs put up really wide. And 9-7 is the final here in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby. We'll see you soon.